Hello viewers, welcome to Elim TV, a station where you watch, interact and also learn. Your tutor today is Mr. Wanyoike, a mathematics teacher. In today's lesson, we are informed to lesson 3 and the topic is reciprocal and the subtopic is reciprocal of number uh, by division method and also by use of mathematical table. On to the lesson objective. By the end of this lesson, you should be able to, number one, explain how to calculate a reciprocal of numbers by division method, and number two, explain how to calculate reciprocal from mathematical reciprocal uh, tables. Uh, computation of reciprocal by division method, in this case, you are supposed to, example one, you are supposed to evaluate the reciprocal of uh, 3.6. And uh, 3.6 is supposed to be uh, written as 1 over 3, uh, 1 over 3.6. And therefore, what you're supposed to do, you're supposed to uh, eliminate the decimal uh, in the denominator by multiplying the numerator and the denominator by 10. And once you multiply, you'll get the numerator as 10 and the denominator becomes uh, 36. And after simplifying by dividing uh, the numerator by 2, you'll get 5 and you, you divide the denominator by 2, you'll get 18. Then using the long division method, you will divide uh, 18 uh, uh, divided by 5 or in, uh, 18 divided by 5 and in this case you find that um, uh, 18 is greater than 5 and therefore it is not possible so you are supposed to put a 0 point then you add a 0 in front of 5 you get 5 uh, you get 50 and after getting 50 you look for a number which you can multiply by 18 you get a number which is uh, near uh, 50 but that which does not exit 50 and you put number 2 number 2 uh, 2 you multiply by 18 you will get 36 and after subtracting uh, 36 from 50 50, you will get a uh, 14 and 14 you find that 14 is less than compared to 18 and therefore you have to in add another number in front of 14 so that you can get 140 and after get uh, adding that zero you'll get 140 you look for another number which you can multiply by 18 you get a number which is closer to 140 and which does not exit 140 and the answer uh, the, the number becomes 7 and 7 you multiply by 18 you get 126 and uh, 126 uh, if you uh, subtract it from 140 you will get the result as a uh, 14 and uh, uh, you will continue uh, uh, using uh, adding 0 and using 7 uh, uh, placing 7 uh, 7 once you multiply by 18 you will end up getting a uh, 126 and after subtracting you will end up getting 14 and the process repeats itself it means that you will have a recurring decimal of where 7 is the recurring number and therefore the answer you will write it as 0 0.2 and 7 and on top of 7 you write a decimal point uh, to show that the 7 is recurring uh, on to the second example find the reciprocal of uh, 0 uh, 0 0.25 uh, 0 0.025 Using division method as we have said you're supposed to uh, write 1 over 0 0.025 then you uh, eliminate the decimal up uh, uh, place uh, points uh, in the denominator by multiplying by a uh, thousand the numerator and also the denominator and uh, after multiplying by a thousand you will get 1000 as the numerator and 25 as the denominator and 1000 once you divide by uh, one by 25 you will end up getting a 40 divided by 1 and um, uh, after uh, 40 divided by 1 you will eventually get the answer as 40 because 40 divided by 1 you will get the result as 40. Uh, we are going to use the mathematical table uh, and in this case we are going to leave uh, to uh, concentrate on reciprocal uh, tables. Uh, we have an example here, uh, 3.6, uh, write uh, 3.6, uh, that is the question about which the reciprocal of 3.6 uh, uh, using reciprocal tables. You are supposed to represent it as, uh, by writing it, uh, the uh, 3.6 as the denominator and 1 as the numerator as you can see. Then uh, number 2, you write the denominator in standard form and uh, uh, the standard form of 3.6 becomes 
around 3.6 times 10 uh, to power 0 because 3.6 is in between uh, 0 and 10 and uh, uh, standard form is a number which is in between which is uh, greater than uh, uh, 1 uh, but uh, it is equal to or greater than 1 but less than 10 and therefore 3.6 becomes 3.6 times 10 to power 0 and you are supposed to look on the mathematical table on the reciprocal tables the reciprocal of 3.6 and in this table you can see uh, the reciprocal of 3.6 if you go to the x column the first column is x column uh, you drop up to where 3.6 is then you move across in the middle column where which it runs from 0 to number 9 uh, you will uh, read uh, 3.6 and you look at the column of 0 in the middle column and you will eventually get the answer as 0 0.2778 as in it is indicated there and therefore that uh, number you multiply 1 the numerator by the reciprocal of 3.6 then the reciprocal of 10 to power 0 is also 10 to power 0 and any number raised to power 0 is equals to 1 and 1 you multiply by 0 0.2778 uh, then you multiply by 1 you eventually get the same answer as 0 0.2778 uh, and then uh, example number 2 find the reciprocal of that number using the reciprocal table in this case you can see that this number is less than 1 and what you are supposed to do you are supposed to write that number with 1 as the numerator and after writing that number with 1 as the numerator uh, then you write the denominator that is 0 0.00374 in standard form and in this case because uh, the number is less than 1 the power should be you shift the decimal point from 0 uh, between 0 and 0 up to 3 uh, between and the number 3 and 7 and the number becomes 3.74 and because you have shifted uh, 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 to three uh, decimal places uh, you will write the power as 10 to power negative 3 then you go to the mathematical table you look at uh, the x column where we have 3.7 and uh, to the middle column you go to the number 4 the column of 4 uh, then you drop up to where it coincide with 3.7 uh, and the number which should be there it reads as 0 0.2 and the cube uh, under the, 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 the reciprocal of 10 to power negative uh, 3 it should be 10 to power positive 3 and therefore you're supposed to multiply by 10 to power positive 3 because the uh, the power must change the sign if you want to look for the reciprocal of it and therefore after that you will get uh, 0.2674 uh, then you are supposed to multiply by a thousand and the answer becomes 264.7 as the answer. Uh, we have come to the end of today's lesson and in this uh, exercise uh, you are supposed to be given an assignment and the question number one you are supposed to evaluate using reciprocal tables and you are supposed to evaluate uh, 3 you divide by 0 0.004 uh, three seven. Uh, the division uh, sign has been long replaced and it is supposed to be in between uh, 3 and 0 0.00437 uh, and the, the next question uh, you are supposed to look for the, uh, the, 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 the reciprocal of 1 you divide by uh, that is 729 uh, that division sign is long replaced it's supposed to be in between uh, 1 and the, uh, and the number which is 3729 uh, that is 1 you divide by 3729 therefore you're supposed to apply the reciprocal table in your computation uh, for reference you can refer from student books mathematics books uh,